Artemis Toast here. Uh, you know, if you watched any of my videos before, you know, uh, I do guitar guitar reviews, you know, as I am the world's greatest guitarist. Um, uh, I will do that for you today. Um, or I had planned to do that for you today, but um, unfortunately, if you've, you've watched some of my videos before, you know that the guitar manufacturers, the, the evil corporations are against me um, in cahoots with the likes of Debbie Gibson on behalf of Gibson Brand Guitars and um, possibly, you know, that's, that's open to um, speculation, I, I suppose, but um, it's a little too, too coincidental. Um, you know, Debbie Gibson, Gibson Guitars, I don't know, you tell me, you know. But, you know, if you watch my guitar reviews, you know, I, ha I have yet to be sent a proper guitar, you know. I was going to review my my, S my Gibson SG, um, you know, Gothic Super Mega Artemis Toast Edition yesterday, but my, my prototype double stacker, Seymour Duncan blackout AT pickups um, require 18 volt batteries, and I, I don't have any. I'm still waiting on those. Um, you know, also last week I had mentioned that I was waiting on something from BC Rich, so um, that's that's what actually came in. Um, so I'll, I'll be doing a review on a BC Rich Warlock um, today. Um, unfortunately. Uh, what they had sent me um, is incomplete, uh, or it was complete and someone messed it up because you know this isn't factory electrical tape in here, um, you know, and you can see cut wires, you know, somebody somebody had cut those. I don't think it was the robots at the factory, um, you know. But this, this is the way they sent it to me. Um, no strings either, but, you know, it wouldn't matter anyway because there's no pickups in it. The, I mean, all you hear is like, you know, the, the strings making noise because they wouldn't be, you know, hooked to an amplifier. Um, yeah, these spaces here used to hold um, humbucking pickups. Um, Now, now it's an empty, you know, void, empty spaces. Um, you know, it's a black, lacquer-like finish. Um, I, you know, although BC Rich is being, um, you know, evil towards me or Debbie Gibson or a combination of the both or a combination of them and the other guitarists in the world, um, you know, despite of all those things, you know, um, that's a good looking body of a guitar, you know, that's, you know, it looks different than most other things, which is a positive thing, even though they hate me. Um, rosewood fretboard, um, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24 frets, uh, 20, 24 stringless frets, uh, yeah, but, you know, it, it would be a nice guitar. I would love to shred it for you. Uh, uh, you know, I, I, all I could, that's all, that's all I could do. I mean, you can't, you can't hear any, you can't hear anything with that. I mean, that's, all you, all you get is tapping. I mean, I can do that. Can't, can't, can't rock out like that. Um. But this is the, the BC Rich Warlock. Um, you know, not only is it incomplete, um, torn apart, um, stringless, and um, it's also the cheap one. They, you know, they must really dislike me because they, they sent me the, the, the cheap one. Um, you know, if it, if it were a Fender, it'd be the Squire. If it was a Gibson, well, it wouldn't even be a Gibson, it'd be an Epiph Epiph Epiphone. Um, you know that's kind of that. BC Rich sent me their their version of their Epiphone, um, so they hate me, and it's it's not even complete. I, I don't know what I did, uh, but once again, um, BC Rich Warlock. Um, 
Thank you, BC Rich, for sending me something, I guess. Thank you know, I, I reviewed it for you, you know. See, you don't know about these things. I, I got to send these back, too, you know. I mean, they give me a return postage and all that, but, you know, they send me send me junk, you know, and, and it, it's here, and I'm kind of obligated, so I still review it. Even when, you know, Fender sent me a, a rock band controller, even when Gibson never even sent me a guitar, um, I, 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 I reviewed a magazine, you know, um, I, I fulfilled my end of the bargain, and I even had to send that Sweetwater catalog back to Gibson. I mean, that's how messed up things are. You don't see behind scenes. Um, but I hope to review uh, an actual guitar for you in the near future. Um, as I stated many, many times before, and as everybody should, I mean, they really should know by now. You know, I'm, I should be in dictionaries on, on that uh that Wikipedia's, you know, the world's greatest guitar is Artemis Toast. I mean, it's it's like, you know, you know, sky's blue. You know, I mean, it, I, I don't know how else to explain it. World's greatest guitar is Artemis Toast. You know, um, bacon, delicious, Taco Bell, awesome. You know, falls under those categories. Um, you know, my hair, luxurious. You know, uh, my hands, magical, Artemis Toast, great, world's greatest guitar. I mean, I don't know how else to put it. Um, on that note, hope to review good, review, once again, hope to review a guitar for you again. Artemis Toast is out.